Hey everybody, welcome back to another business analysis video. I'm so excited to do this video because this is my first video for the year 2024. So happy new year and welcome to our first video for the year. In today's video, we are embarking on a journey towards securing your first BA role this year, 2024. Whether you're fresh out of university or moving careers, this is your year this is your year so hit the like button subscribe and let's unlock the door to your future in business analysis first things first embrace this journey if you probably have a new year's resolution to become a business analyst this year i want you to embrace the journey Securing your first BA role is not just one step, it's a leap towards a future filled with opportunities as well as challenges. So I want you to try to believe in yourself because your unique perspective and skills are invaluable for the role of business analysis because I trust that you've done some personal analysis to understand the skills and techniques required for business analysis and how you can begin to improve the ones that you lack. Secondly, I want you to equip yourself with knowledge. 2024 is a dynamic world of business and technology. So keep learning, dive into business analysis fundamentals, get familiar with the latest tools and trends that we use as business analysts. And don't forget the power of data analytics because as business analysts, we also do perform data analysis. And finally, knowledge is not just power, it's your toolkit for success. So explore various BA courses, explore the fundamentals in business analysis, link in description box for resources to help you to explore those fundamentals for business analysis. Okay. The third thing that I want you to do this year, 2024 is to build a network. Becoming a business analyst is like I mentioned, challenging. So you can't just sit in your house and expect for something to come up, right? You need to build a network. Connect, 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 because networking is key for business analysts. How do you do this? Attend industry meetups, join online forums, and engage on platforms such as LinkedIn. LinkedIn is very good for um, connecting, making connections and building your network. And you just never know, every person you meet could be a doorway to new opportunities in the business analysis space. Again, if you like resources on how to build your network, click the link in description box. Now, the fourth thing I want you to do for this year, 2024, to reach your dream or your goal for becoming a business analyst is to tailor your CV and your portfolio. Work on your CV. Your CV is your story, is your experience, and you want to showcase that. Tailor them to highlight your problem-solving skills, your analytical skills, and any relevant projects that you've worked on or any case studies. So make it possible for recruiters to not overlook you. So once you've prepared your CV, what is next? What is next? You can't just leave it sitting on your, on your computer, right? The next thing you want to do is ace your interviews. Interviews can be daunting, I know, um, but think of it as your stage because they're also your stage, your stage for you to showcase your skills and talk about what you can bring onto the role of business analysis. So how do you do this? You want to communicate your understanding of business analysis role with clarity and confidence. And remember, it's as much about your soft skills and attitude as it is about your technical know-how. So business analysis encompasses various things, three key things really, your soft skills, your technical BA skills, and your domain knowledge. So make sure you've tackle those three <laughs> areas. Again, preparation gives you confidence. In order for you to ace your interview, you need to prepare. If you'd like resources on how to prepare for future interviews around business analysis, I have top 20 questions and answers for business analyst interview. Link in description box. Now, the final thing I want you to do this year is to be persistent and positive. Why am I saying this? As much as you are applying for BA roles, I've, from a lot of my mentees, I've received um, worries about rejections, rejections from job applications, re rejections after interviews. I want you to remember that these are not failures. Having rejection is not failure, but it's a stepping stone right? So I want you to, as much as you would get these rejections, keep being persistent and stay positive. Don't 
jump out of the queue and leave all the hard work that you've built up to go to waste. Because each interview, each application gets you closer to where you want to be. So if it gets to a point where you're almost, <laughs> almost there <laughs> and you give up, you just never know. So please try to keep persistent and keep positive. Eventually your determination will pay off. Don't give up. Just keep pushing and keep going. If this is really what you want to do for this year, if you want to become a business analyst this year, please keep being persistent and positive. And you can't just only be persistent and positive. Again, you need to put in the work, you need to prepare. So I hope that these key tips will help you for this year, 2024. So to conclude this video, I want to remind you that the path to business analysis this year, 2024, is at your fingertips, is at your toes, is at your feet. So I want you to equip yourself with knowledge, build your network, showcase your skills and embrace each challenge with a resilient spirit. Be resilient. Okay? So share your journey with us in the comment section below. And if you're ready to take on 2024 with me, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe for more inspiration and guidance. Here's to your success and I'll see you in my next one. Peace.